Unfortunately, I couldn't be in Las Vegas for tonight's event, but I hope you all will watch us on SportsCenter later tonight. And our show repeats all night, so even if you're out late tonight in Vegas, you can still catch us. I'd like to thank Kevin Hooks and Ryan Myers in the Las Vegas Urban League for this award. I've always appreciated the important work of the Urban League and the towering figures who've led its fight for improving the lives of Americans through the fight for civil rights and justice. I'm fortunate to count National Urban League President Mark Morial as a longtime friend from our hometown of New Orleans. And I've always admired his leadership and his devotion to the Urban League and its mission. My job is to cover sports, but as you all know, sports often intersects with race and culture in our society. That's been evident in stories such as the protests against injustice and police brutality led by NFL players such as Colin Kaepernick. Given the opportunity for commentary on this story, I tried my best to explain the nature of the protest and the frustration of those who seek justice to have to resort to protest to have their voices heard. In the NFL and in the NBA, as well as college football and basketball, many of the African-American athletes come from communities served by the Urban League. You all, as much as anyone, are aware of the struggles and sacrifices they face along the way. And stories such as the recent one involving Sterling Brown and his unfortunate handling by the Milwaukee police officers remind us that the quest for justice and equality is still real, even for those who become famous multimillionaire athletes. In telling their stories, and try to share the humanity of those we cover to exhibit them as real people who just happen to be gifted athletes. It's gratifying to know that it resonates to such a degree that you would honor me in this way. I'm humbled and appreciative. Once again, I'm sorry I could not attend tonight, but I wish you all a great evening and continued success in the critical work that you do to improve our society for those who are often overlooked.